What's up everyone? Welcome to another round of Young Seven Yang Game Reviews. Good news. Really, really good news. Sega finally got it right. That's it everyone. Sega finally got it right. Here, we're looking at the first Sonic game in 20 years, I'm sorry, 21 years, that is actually pretty damn good. Um, I'm sorry, maybe I'm exaggerating years a bit. Well, I'm going to be nice and I'm going to say 16 years. That is pretty damn good. Uh, this totally reminds me of the original Sonic the Hedgehog, uh, Sonic and Knuckles, uh, Sonic the Hedgehog through Sonic and Knuckles that came out on the original Sega Genesis. The gameplay is dead on, the music they pulled straight out of the original Sonic and mixed it a bit. Um, I'm in love with this game and it's very fun to play. My only hope is that Sega gets it right with the full game this time, not just the demo but the full game. Uh, this level is amazing and it's for someone as old as I am who's played the original Sonic game and enjoyed it as much as I have, uh, I'm totally going to pick this up when it comes out. And my only hope is that the full game is as good as this one level. That's my only hope and fear because there's been a couple of other Sonic games in the past recent years that have looked promising but at the end of the day, you know, fell short. So I'm hoping that this time around, um, this game is pretty good. And one of the cool things about this game, I'm going to say right off the bat, is um, it's basic. It's basic. It's fun. It's um, it's, a, it's platforming at its core. Uh, what they did was they took it's like they took the original Sonic game and they masked it with 3D graphics, which is perfectly fine. Um, the levels are huge. There's multiple ways to get to the end. Uh, you're seeing me play the you're seeing me play through one of the levels right here, or one of the levels, the only level right here. And uh, I've played through this level now probably about three or four times, uh, each time uh, going through it in a different way. Now I'm kind of rushing through this level because I don't want to keep I want to keep this video at a minimum today. But um, yeah, but you know I just want to let you guys know that I think and I hope that Sega finally got it right and they produced a Sonic game worthy of the title Sonic. And if you are as old as I am. You're gonna love this game, especially if you, especially if you played the original Sonic games. Um, if you're the newer generation of gamers, I would definitely say pick this up based on this based on this demo. It was definitely worth picking up. And I guarantee you'll enjoy it. Uh, Sonic is all about speed and platforming, and in recent years, that 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 whole ideology, that theory, has been completely shot. Now the only thing they didn't show in the demo, which I was pretty disappointed about, was they didn't show the newer Sonic. This is called Sonic Generations, and as the uh, preview trailer shows, you play with both Sonic, Sonic of the old and Sonic of the new. So my hope is that the Sonic of the new stages are just as fun as the Sonic of the old stages. Now, Sonic, when it was released on Sega Dreamcast, was a decent Sonic game. They had a couple of, they had two of them, and they were both pretty damn good. Especially Sonic, uh, Sonic Adventures 2 was actually quite decent. The only thing that made it bad for me was the multiple characters. Sometimes you only want to play Sonic or Knuckles, and that's about it.